गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स टूडे वी विल डू क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर ऑफ एक्सरसाइज थ्री पॉइंट वन क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर इज वेरीफाइड बाई एज इज ए पाच इज थ्री लैख नाइंटी फाइव थाउजेंड सिक्स हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी सिक्स प्लस वन लैख फोर्टी नाइन थाउजेंड एंड फोर्टी फाइव इज इक्वल टू वन लैख फोर्टी नाइन थाउजेंड एंड फोर्टी फाइव प्लस order property of addition in order property of addition when we when we add two numbers and we change their order then the sum of both the sides are equal now let's check it let us add these two numbers this side that is left hand side and these two numbers on the right hand side this rhs stands for right hand side we added both the numbers and we get the answer 544671 and here also 544671 both side the sum is same so lhs is equal to rhs left hand side is equal to right hand side so order property of addition is verified now children we are doing c part c part is 186395 Plus zero is equal to one lakh eighty-six thousand three hundred and ninety-five. That is, there is zero property. In zero property, if we add zero to any number, then we get the sum that is number itself. Now let's verify it again. Divide the page in two parts. One is left hand side, another is right hand side. Now let's add zero to a number. We will get the same number. Here is also the same number that is one lakh eighty six thousand three hundred and ninety five. It means LHS is equal to RHS, hence verified. D part three lakh fifty two thousand eight hundred and fifty nine plus one is equal to three lakh fifty two thousand eight hundred and sixty. Here, if we add one to any number, then it gives us the successor of that number. It is also one of the property of addition. Now let's prove it. Again, divide the page into two equal parts. Now this side is left hand side. This side is right hand side. Now we will add one to the number and we'll get the sum that is three lakh fifty two thousand eight hundred and sixty, which is equal to RHS. Hence, verified. Now E part. Eight lakh forty six thousand two hundred and fifty one plus seventy three thousand two hundred and twenty four plus one thousand eight hundred and forty nine is equal to eighty eight lakh forty six thousand two hundred and fifty one plus seventy three thousand two hundred and twenty four plus one thousand eight hundred and forty nine. This e part involves associative property of addition. In associative property of addition, the sum of three numbers or more than three numbers will remain the same, regardless of their grouping. Now let's prove it. Again, divide the uh, divide your registers into two equal parts. Now this is LHS and this is RHS. First of all, we will add those two numbers which are there in brackets. We added these two numbers and we get the sum. That is nine lakh nineteen thousand four hundred and seventy-five. Now this is the third number. Now we will add this third number in the sum of these two numbers. Look here. Now we will add these two numbers and we will get the final sum. Now LHS is equal to nine lakh twenty-one thousand three hundred and twenty-four. Now we will solve RHS. Now these two numbers are in bracket, so we will solve these two numbers first. We will add these two numbers and we will get the sum. Now we will add the first number to the sum of these two numbers. Look here, I forgot it over here. Eight lakh forty six thousand two hundred and fifty one plus seventy five thousand and seventy three. Then we get the sum that is nine lakh twenty one thousand three hundred and twenty four. Again, LHS is equal to RHS. Hence, our associative property of addition is verified. 